Ali here at mindwavemeditation.com and today we are going to talk about how to make life easier right here, right now. So keep watching this video, like the video, comment on the video, share the video and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification if you want to see when the videos come in and I'll see you on the other side where we're going to learn the most simplest way to tune into all of life and realise that it doesn't have to be all doom and gloom and we can manage it easily if we just know how. Whoa. So how do we do it? How do we live so easily? How do we go through life amongst this, these crazy times and all the things that we have to deal with, our family, our work, our emotions, our past memories, our future anxieties, our fears, our worries, our doubts, all the shame and all the guilt. All the hopes and dreams. Will I ever achieve those dreams? Will I ever achieve those things that I really want? When can I truly start living? Can I live right now? They say I can live right now, but what does that really mean? My life isn't how I want it right now. So therefore, do I imagine it all to be? Is that, what, what's that about? It's all very confusing. And if you're watching these kind of videos, you'll be having these kind of questions. So I thought I'd just break it down really, really simply to just some bare essentials. And I think it's as simple as this. Number one. Decide who you are, what you want to do in life, and create a strategy to get that thing done. Choose one thing, do it really, 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 really well, as best as you can possibly do it. Spin those plates, make it happen, create those sacrifices that you need to, look at your habits, watch out for distractions, commit to that thing. Commit to that thing like it was the last thing you had to do on earth and make it happen no matter what by being a good person and get the job done. That's my number one, 100%. And once you lean into that and once you find that thing, then you start to live from a different place. You start to live with a, from a place of purpose. And when you get out of bed in the morning, even if you've got kids running around and you know, you've, you're working a job you don't necessarily love, you know, uh, the perspective of I am a mother or a father and I'm bringing up these kids so they can be great people and I'm working this job, but it's all for the greater good of bringing up these human beings into, in the world and I'm gonna make them as best as I possibly can from the skills that I know, I'm still gonna honor my passions and you know, be a good person and I'm gonna be the best parent I can possibly be. That's an incredible thing to do. That's probably one of the most incredible things you can do as a human being on this planet is bring another human into this world and make them a good person with good morals and values and to honor and nurture them, okay? Okay, that's, that's huge. Let's break it down to something smaller. You don't really know who you are, but you know there's something in there. Maybe it's a hobby or a passion. You just gotta keep leaning into it. Find that thing, find that thing. Link below, Dare to Discover. Made a little mini course for you to find that thing and push you over the edge to do it. Just to kind of nudge you, give you a little nudge. Go on, there you go. That's what that's for, it's awesome. Give it a whirl. Number two. We've got our thing, we're living from a place of purpose. We're starting to fall in love with life again because we've got a reason to be here. We're not just going through the motions of living. We've all done that, it's rubbish. We're just going through the motions we're like, oh, this is my job, this is my life, this is what I do. No, no, we can't do that anymore. We can't do that anymore. We've got to live from a place of purpose 
because when we live from purpose, we're creating harmony, we're creating balance, we're creating peace in the world. And creating peace in the world is way better than just going through the motions of living and not really caring what you're contributing to, who you're contributing to. Are you working for a company that does loads of bad stuff? Does that make you feel good? You know, realize that all of life is mental. And I mean that in the sense that your memories of the things that cause you pain and suffering are a mental projection that you play, that you replay over and over and over and over again. And the same for your future um, anxieties, worries, desires, thoughts, the mental projections that you play over and over and over again. So we have these two, past and future, constantly coming at us like this. And if you watch this kind of stuff, we talk about being in the now, and the now is free from all this. That's why you look like this sometimes, because it's beautiful and it's peaceful and it's calming. And right now we don't have to think about the past or the future. We can just be here now. We can be happy now in the moment. And you notice when we slow it down, it gets a bit uncomfortable for some but just sit in the silence for 10 seconds. Shoot into that smile. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> it's awesome. Feels great. Because you're free from all of that past and future and it's gonna come at you every day, all the time. Sorry, my battery went. And the key is to know that it's data, it's information, it's memory, it's emotions just running wild. And if we've got this passion and this purpose, and we know that the breath and tuning into the heart can bring us into the now. Oh, we've got purpose and we've got presence. These two together are your golden ticket. These two together are your golden ticket out of here, out of the suffering and stress. Passion and presence equal peace, absolutely. And I think if we really dig in, we can find a third one. But these two are pretty hot, so really, really get into this today. And really, really tune into your passion and tune in to the heart space and tune in through the breath, however you want, the crown of the head, you could do it through affirmation or prayer or um, connecting to nature just hearing the birds, hearing the birds, thank you. <laughs> um, I, I pay them well, you know, it's just when they slack off like that, they're meant to be here on call. Tune into the birds, tune into the wind, anything that can bring you back to the present moment. And if you practice it, if you practice tuning in, as many times in the day, just even for 15 seconds.
can realize that we can find peace within ourselves instead of looking for it out there. It's always within. We just have to tune in. So number three, we've got passion. We've got presence and peace. Number three would be just to remember. Remember this concept. Remember that life is happening all around us. It doesn't define us. We can choose in the moment how we react, how we respond, what we subscribe to, what we commit to, what we engage in, what habits we decide to keep replaying or allowing. We have a choice, a conscious choice, to change the path at any point. Change your friends. <laughs> if you've got crappy friends, come out. So remember, 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 remember to be present now, to be here now, to be happy now, to be. Simply just be whenever you can. Tune in. Tune in and just remember that life is whatever you make of it. It really is down to you to allow what you want to allow into your life. I allow you to write lots of nice comments and like the video and share it. I do, I allow it. <laughs> um, I hope you have the most amazing day. Tell me all about it. I'd love to connect with you. I'd love to know who I'm talking to. Again, like I've said before, it's quite difficult to connect, but the people that do connect, I absolutely love you and it's really nice to know who you are and have these little conversations. And some of you I get to teach and we I coach some of you and we have these amazing transformational journeys. You know, you know who you are. Uh, if you're interested in that, click the website link down below and uh, have a little scan around that website. Lots of free stuff and lots of awesome stuff in there. And I'll see you on the next one.